Hey guys, I'm Nisha Homi. Today I'm sharing a protein and fiber rich Makhana Chivida recipe. This Makhana Chivida is ideal to include as a healthy snack in your weight loss journey. Especially if you have health issues like thyroid, PCOS or if you simply want to eat healthy in your weight loss journey. So let's get started with the recipe. Into my cast iron kadai, I'm adding in 150 grams of makhana. And on medium to low flame, I'm roasting the makhana. Makhana needs to be roasted really well. Makhanas are also known as lotus seeds or fox nuts. They are low in glycemic index, they are gluten free, high in protein and low in calories. Hence an ideal snack to include in your weight loss journey. It's about 7 to 8 minutes now and let's check on the makana and see whether it is roasted well. So I'm just taking a makana and I'm crushing it with my fingers and if it crushes easily then the makana is nicely roasted. I'm taking another makana and crushing it with my fingers. So if it crushes easily like this then the makana is roasted. I'm going to transfer the roasted makanas to another bowl. And I'm going to keep this aside. Into the kadai, I'm adding in 2 tablespoon A2 desi ghee. Instead of A2 desi ghee, you can use any locally sourced wood pressed oils of your choice. Once the ghee is heated, I'm adding in 1 third cup raw peanuts. And on low flame, I'm lightly roasting the peanuts in desi ghee. I prefer to use A2 desi ghee. However, you can use any locally sourced wood pressed oils of your choice if you are a vegan. Once the peanuts are lightly roasted and has started to crack a bit, I'm adding in 1 fourth cup of sliced almonds. Remember this is a heavy bottomed cast iron kadai and I'm doing the process on low flame. Lightly roast the badam as well. Once the badam starts to get roasted, I'm adding in 1 fourth cup of cashew nuts. Once the cashew nuts starts to get lightly roasted, I'm adding in 1 fourth cup of chana dal. This is also known as puttu kadala in Malayalam. Roasted chana dal is a very good source of protein. Lightly roasting the puttu kadala as well. Next I'm adding in 2 tablespoon pumpkin seeds, 2 tablespoon sunflower seeds. And once the sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds starts to crackle, I'm adding in 2 tablespoons of flax seeds. Flax seeds are a good source of omega-3 healthy fats, fiber and protein. For a subtle sweetness, I'm adding in 1 fourth cup black raisins and I'm roasting the raisins as well. Instead of the nuts and seeds I'm using in this recipe, you can play around and add in your favorite nuts and seeds. You can omit the black raisins and add in golden raisins. You can just play around with this recipe to suit your taste. Into this I'm adding in 2 teaspoons Kashmiri chilli powder. You can increase chilli powder as per your taste. 1 third teaspoon turmeric powder. Today I'm using Vigon turmeric which has high curcumin content. Half teaspoon freshly ground black pepper powder. Pink Himalayan salt as needed. 1 teaspoon Amchur powder and give this a quick mix. Quickly add in the roasted makanas and stir well. Once nicely mixed, I'm turning off the flame and then immediately transfer this to another bowl. Allow this to cool down completely and once it is cooled down, you can store it in an airtight glass container and it will stay good for many months. And my super healthy Makhana Chivida is ready to serve. So guys, do try this healthy Chivida recipe and uh, let me know how it turned out. Thank you for watching and until next time, take care. Bye-bye.